Hi guys, welcome back. If you are returning, welcome if this is your first time stopping by. If you are newly subscribed, welcome and thank you. Today I'm bringing you my recipe for meatloaf. Meatloaf is so simple to make. I haven't made it in a while, but I'm making it tonight, so I thought I would share that with you. I have one pound of ground beef in that bowl. You can use whatever kind of ground meat you like. Red peppers, green peppers, tomato, onion, breadcrumbs, an egg, and a sauce. Please check the description box for measurements as usual. So let's get started. I'm going to crack my egg into the meat and season it, and then I will mix that in nicely before I add the rest of my ingredients. My oven is preheating to 350 degrees and I have my loaf pan ready to go. So I've mixed in the egg with the meat and I'm going to add the rest of my ingredients, starting with the peppers, onions, and tomatoes. I will now use my hand to work this in. You can certainly use a spoon, but as you know, I am not afraid to use my hands in the kitchen. I'm going to go ahead and add the breadcrumbs and work that in as well. And last but not least, I'll add two tablespoons of my sauce mix and um, mix that into the meat. And then I'll fold, fold that, mold that into a loaf and then drop it into my pan and try to level it out. And then I'll grab our sauce, the remaining sauce, and pour that over the meatloaf and also just spread that um, all over the top. And then again, I'm at 350. This will go in the oven for 50 minutes to an hour. And lo and behold, here we go. Here is our meatloaf. You'll end up with some liquid in there. You can pour that out or allow it to dry out or just take your meatloaf out and put it on the platter like this. And there it is, guys. Get your rice, your couscous, um, your mashed potatoes, or if you want to make a sandwich, go for it. Give it a shot. Let me know what you think, and I'll catch you next time. Bye-bye.